I'm Kimberly Kay with your entertainment report from MidHudsonNews.com. In the spirit of Halloween, Jessica Simpson dressed up like a mummy and tweeted a photo of her holding her belly and she wrote what most people already had figured out weeks ago. It's true, I am going to be a mummy. <sighs> this will be the first child for Simpson and her fiancé, Eric Johnson. They announced their engagement last year. Apparently, pregnancy won't slow Simpson down. She signed up to be a mentor on the upcoming NBC reality show Fashion Star, along with Nicole Richie. Well, thanks to his grandmother, Mickey Rourke knows about the old-time actors whose hand and footprints are in the cement at Groman's Chinese Theater in Hollywood. That's where Rourke had his prints immortalized on Monday. He was emotional and had to compose himself before saying, she knew all about these people here. I used to watch TV and she'd tell me who Errol Flynn was and who Ronald Coleman was. Of course, her favorite actor was a gangster actor, kind of George Raft. So that runs in the family, he said. Rourke also said his grandmother taught him manners and not to stand around with a toothpick in his mouth. Wow. Rourke's next movie is The Immortals. So first week back on Broadway, Hugh Jackman is raking it in. His one-man show pulled in more than $1.2 million at the box office during eight preview performances last week. Hugh Jackman back on Broadway beat out How to Succeed in Business with Daniel Radcliffe and the revival of Follies. In Jackman's show, he and an 18 Peaks orchestra perform songs from his stage and film career, and the official opening isn't even until November 10th. Well, you know those who said Kim Kardashian's marriage to Chris Humphreys wouldn't last certainly got it right. So a whole lot of bar bets might need to be paid off now. Yes, she filed for divorce on Monday, checking the box that says irreconcilable differences. And since their courtship and over-the-top wedding was followed by so many, Kardashian felt she had to explain herself. So she issued a statement that says, I hope everyone understands this was not an easy decision. I had hoped this marriage was forever, but sometimes things don't work out as planned. Hmm. Well, Humphreys tells TMZ.com, though, that he's devastated and is willing to do whatever it takes to make it work. Apparently, he found out through the internet that he was getting a divorce. They do have a prenup. It's not known, though, if that covers the 20 carat engagement ring Chris gave Kim. This was her second marriage and his first. In local entertainment news, the Crystal Method, the internationally acclaimed American electronic music duo created in LA by Ken Jordan and Scott Kirkland in the early 1990s lives on at Orient Poughkeepsie. They will bring their electrifying sound to downtown Poughkeepsie's most exclusive ultra lounge on November 12th. Doors open at 10. For VIP table reservations, call Orient Poughkeepsie at 337-4848. Orient is located at 319 Main Street in downtown Poughkeepsie. That's your latest entertainment report for a new update daily. Log on to MidHudsonNews.com. I'm Kimberly Kay.